Now we are going to solve. Do this page number 53, chapter 3 polynomials. In this, it is given that if p of x is equal to x square minus 5x minus 6, then find the value of p of 1, p of 2, p of 3, p of 0, p of minus 1, p of minus 2, and p of minus 3. To find this one, first to write a given polynomial p of x is equal to x square minus 5x minus 6. Let this one as a equation 1. Next, to find the p of o, 1 substitute x is equal to 1 in equation 1. After substituting, we get p of 1 is equal to 1 square minus 5 into 1 minus 6. After simplification, we can write 1 square as 1 and 5 into 1 is minus 5. Here, minus 6 same as it is. Next, after simplification, we can write 1 minus 11 because minus 5 minus 6 is equal to 11. So, next after simplification, subtraction, we get 1 minus 11 is equal to minus 10. Therefore, we can write p of 1 is equal to minus 10. Next to find the value of p of 2, substitute x is equal to in equation 1. Then we get p of 2 is equal to 2 square minus 5 into 2 minus 6. After simplification, we can write it as 2 square as 4, 5 into 2, 10 and minus 6, same as this. After simplification, we can write 4 minus 16. And next, after simplification, we can write a minus 12. Therefore, we can write p of 2 is equal to minus 12. To find the value of p of 3, substitute x is equal to 3 in equation 1. Then we get p of 3 is equal to 3 square minus 5 into 3 minus 6. After simplification, we can write it as 3 square as 9 and 5 into 3 is 15 and minus 6 same as this. Further simplification, we can write it as 9 minus 20. 1. After simplification, we get a minus 12. Therefore, we can write p of 3 is equal to minus 12. Next, to find the value of p of 0, substitute x is equal to 0 in equation 1. Then we can write p of 0 is equal to 0 square minus 5 into 0 minus 6. Here, 0 square means 0. 5 into 0 is 0 minus 6. Same as it is. After simplification, we can write a minus 6. Therefore, we can write p of 0 is equal to minus 6. To find the value of p of minus 1, substitute x is equal to minus 1 in equation 1. After Substitution we get p of minus 1 is equal to minus 1 whole square minus 5 into minus 1 minus 6. After simplification we can write 1 minus 1 whole square as 1 and minus 5 into minus 1 is plus 5 and minus 6 m as t is. After simplification we can write 6 minus 6. 6 minus 6 is 0. Therefore, we can write p of minus 1 is equal to 0. Next, to find the value of p of minus 2, substitute x is equal to minus 2 in equation 1. After substitution, we get p of minus 2 is equal to minus 2 whole square minus 5 into minus 2 minus 6. Here, minus 2 whole square written as plus 4 and minus 5 into minus 2 is plus 10 and minus 6 same as t is. After simplification, we get plus 14 minus 6. 14 minus 6 is 8. Therefore, we can write p of minus 2 is equal to 8. Next to find the value of p of minus 3, substitute x is equal to minus 3 in equation 1. After substituting, we get p of minus 3 is equal to minus 3 whole square minus 5 into minus 3 minus 6. After simplification, we can write minus 3 whole square as 9 plus 9 and minus 5 into minus 3 is equal to plus 15 into minus 6 same as it is. After simplification, we can write 24 minus 6. Further, after simplification, we can write 24 minus 6 is equal to 18. Therefore, P of minus 3 is equal to 18. Next, we now we solve the second problem. It is given that if P of m is equal to m square minus 3m plus 1, then find the values of P of 1 and P of minus 1. First, we write given polynomial P of x is equal to m square minus 3m plus 1. Let this one as a equation 1. To find the value of p of 1, substitute m is equal to 1 in equation 1. After substituting, we get p of 1 is equal to 1 square minus 3 into 1 plus 1. After simplification, we can write 1 square as 1 and 3 into 1 is 3 and plus 1 same as it is. After simplification, we can write minus 2 plus 1. After simplification, minus 2 plus 1 is equal to, we can write a minus 1. Therefore, p of 1 is equal to minus 1.
next to find the value of p of minus 1 substitute term is equal to minus 1 in equation 1 after substituting we get p of minus 1 is equal to minus 1 whole square minus 3 into minus 1 plus 1 after simplification we can write minus 1 whole square as plus 1 and minus 3 into minus 1 is plus 3 plus 1 same as it is after simplification we can write p of minus 1 is equal to 5 Please like, share, subscribe our channel for latest updates by pressing the bell icon.